morning, good morning. Now there were three separate locations where break-ins happened overnight in West Palm Beach. This tri-rail station, and then two other locations. We'll tell you about that later. But look, there's evidence still here: glass shatter from this vehicle, and also the window broken out. Police are kind of wrapping up, getting uh, information on this incident that happened early this morning. Now, a tri-rail security guard tells me they noticed the vehicles broken into just before 3 o'clock this morning. Police tell me so far 15 vehicles were broken into and what looks to be a smash and grab, break out the vehicle's windows and grab anything of value inside. Now, out of the vehicles, police have checked so far, they were the doors were locked. Now, police also tell me that a good portion of these vehicles in this parking lot that were damaged were from out of town. At this time, police do not have any leads. Now, I've just learned that police are also investigating several other overnight car break-ins just a few blocks away at a Holiday Inn on Belvedere Road and an office complex on Central Park Drive. Now, police don't know yet if all of these instances are related, and at this time, they're looking to contact the uh, car owners as well. Reporting in West Palm Beach, Jimmy Johnson, WPBF 25 News.